Hello everyone, my name is Komusan and this is FNAF Weekly News where I cover the past week's FNAF news. We got some more news and more information on the free FNAF book that comes out on August 3rd and information if Steel War will be at PAX. If you like this video, please like and subscribe because I cover the FNAF Weekly News every Saturday, so might as well subscribe. But let's start off with the more. So we got our first look at YouTube's Mankind exclusive dog haunted Five Nights at Freddy's videos available to pre-order right now. So we got some uh, dog haunted videos of the classic FNAF animatronics. So we got Buddy, Chica, Foxy, Bonnie, and Golden Freddy. So they have like all wet eyes and something like that. Uh, they are available to pre-order right now. So if you're interested, pick them up and I hope you enjoy them. Also, the YouTube's Withered Plussies and Daycare Attendant Pins are now available. I tried to enter a giveaway, I didn't win like usual, but you can now get all these, these full plusies of the withered animatronics and the pins and accessories are just all daycare attendant stuff. So if you like daycare attendant, like Sun and Moon, check that out. Or if you just like FNAF 2 withered animatronics, you can also get some epic plusies. YouTube has also released a concept art for plusies of Phantom Chica from Five Nights at Freddy's 3. So one is whole classic design. It's just, you know, got, she looks dark get her eyes and stuff like that and there's also another one of her looking like a watermelon if you don't know people really joke about phantom chica they call her watermelon chica and i guess they that might become a design in the future which is pretty funny when you think about it but uh it's just concept art so we don't know anything about that yet but yeah it's very cool that phantom chica of all characters is getting some more also, the Chuck E. Cheese Plus by YouTube's releases on July 23rd, available for only 7 days. So if you want this classic Chuck E. Cheese Plus, you got 7 days on July 23rd to get it. So, pick it up, be quick, be quick, pick up Chuck E. Cheese. We also got some amazing book news. So we got our uh, the first look at the official cover for Five Nights at Freddy's VIP Volume Zero and Scholastic's new interactive novel series. Releasing for free on August 3rd for the Five Nights at Freddy's 10th anniversary. So, we got a first look at the cover of the image. So, last time we read the synopsis of what's going to happen in the book. And it mentions something about a pig animatronic or something like that. And here's what it looks like. It's like some witch pig dude. I don't know why they didn't just use the pig pets. Because we already got a pig animatronic. But instead, we got this witch looking pig with big glasses, a top hat, a bow, and a like a wand for some reason and uh he seems pretty evil he seems like he's a personification of greed so that's very interesting uh august already comes out so i would definitely be making a video on it now that was all for the book news the news this week there is not a lot of news i could talk about something else but we also got a uh we also got some accelerated news so Kellen Goff is officially voicing Freddy Fazbear and Funko Fusion. Here's what he said. It is an understatement to say I'm grateful and humble to be appointed to the war I've dreamt of for feeling for eight years. And I'm pretty sure this dude is the voice actor for Funtime Buddy and uh, Glamrock Buddy. So he is basically Buddy Fazbear when you think about it. There's also other roles he did. I like to uh, talk about his other roles. He did Diavala and Jojo Part 5. And overhaul i'm pretty sure in my hero academia so he did some great voice work he already did some stuff for the series i'm pretty sure i could be wrong though uh tell me in the comments if i'm wrong but it's gonna be awesome that he's gonna be voicing Freddy fazbear also steel war has officially announced that five nights of Freddy's fourth day bash running from august 29th to september 2nd at pax west so basically they are going to be at pax West on August 23rd to September 20th, uh, 2nd. So there could be some announcement. There could not be some announcement. It's really up to them, basically, if there is anything they want to talk about. But I have a feeling that uh, next month at the beginning, you know, they have an announcement or something. This is a special announcement that I think Steel was going to be giving. So it could be a game and they might show it off here, which would be pretty awesome because that's at the end of the month. So that could be very cool. We also got some final news. It's fan game news. A legacy demo of Five Nights at Candy's spinoff game, FNAF Five Nights at Candy's 4, has been released. Happy 9th anniversary of Five Nights at Candy's. I hope you enjoyed the demo. So this is a demo of um, basically a spinoff game of Five Nights at Candy's that the creator has been working on. It is not a substitute for uh, Five Nights at Candy's 4. So 
this don't worry Fina uh, five nights at candy's four is still coming just this is his own thing it's more like a mario game it looks very mario-esque it's pixel art and it looks like so basically you're playing as candy and sydney and you're collecting all of candy's four and that's the main thing about the game so yeah very cool very cool news that is all the fnaf news for this week it wasn't a lot of news surprisingly but in like two weeks we're going to be getting a ton of news like so much news it's going to be crazy but if you like this video please like and subscribe uh also push the notification bell if you do it helps me out out a lot so i can get more watch hours also please watch my videos if you do subscribe i need watch hours so i can start making money off of youtube because i would really love to do that and uh yeah so i will see you guys later